Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Let It Die. So, there have been a couple of things that have happened since the previous episode. You will notice that this is a new fighter we've created. It's a 4 star striker with 150 strength and 18 bonus strength from the Knight's Helm. Plus 12% strength. We've equipped the decals for stamina consumption efficiency. Increased our maximum stamina by 50%. That doesn't show up on the stats. And we have the sprinter decal for longer sprinting. The dumbbell for a bit of extra attack. I'd love to equip even more damage increasing decals, but those would require mushroom trading and I'm saving the mushrooms for Poison Eater. So, in this episode we'll be kicking the ass of some bosses and uh, doing some quests that are seasonal. Some seasonal boss killing quests. Uh, quests. Quests. Let's see. Uh, yep. <coughs> May Jin's got some tips for us. Yeah, sure, I can chat. I just let this guy win the first two rounds. Here, I got a tip for you. Leave Goto 9's aura alone. Goto 9 has some nasty attacks with its slippery vomit and stuff. Its body press is especially painful. Run and jump to evade it, and don't get close when its aura emerges. How to attack? Well, it likes mushrooms, so try throwing some. I don't know about that. Or a thing. I've attacked him through that. No problem. Oh, Uncle Death is the best. Like, so amazing, so handsome, so strong. Like, oh, hi, skateboarding. The best ever. Like, I just wish I could be a tiny little bug attached to his skateboard and go wherever he goes. I don't even care if he squished me. He's the best. He's totally gonna go pro skateboarder. I know it. I just feel it in my bones. In my hair. Alrighty then. <laughs> you were sleeping with your mouth open. Just so you know. Come on, let's play. Okay, that's a major tip. Uh, another thing, we've got the motorcycle unlocked and the mastery is fully leveled. So let's have a look at that. Mastery level, the claw that's done. We found one of these off a hunter. There's a hater weapon. There it is. So the attack power has increased in multiple stages. Attack 1, charge attack, unlock new move, cyclone attack, charge and use with L2 or R2. Okay, so you can just charge up your attack. Mastery level 10 is skill, unlock a new move, uh, wheel spin hell. That's a weird one, I'd show it off but it costs a ridiculous amount of, master uh, of weapon durability so I'm not going to bother. We kind of grind the wheel on against the ground and cause sparks to shoot up for uh, some uh, combination attack, like uh, a continuous stream of, uh, I guess, durability damage. Let's see, a bunch of attack power increase. Anything else? Where's the combo increase? I'm sure there's one. Charge attack. Okay, can't really see it anywhere. That's odd. Well, the weapon does start off having just one attack. You start off the weapon just being able to dead, uh, just do that and nothing else. But it gains a combo attack. You can hit twice, and you can charge up either of those attacks by holding the button. And you can keep holding it, so you can set a trap for your enemy, and then cover a large amount of distance. You can also charge up the second attack of the combo. <clears throat> oh, 
or you could charge off the second attack combo of the uh, offhand weapon. It's all good. I guess I'll show it off anyway. This is the ground grind attack that does a whole bunch of durability damage to the weapon, but also to whatever gets hit by it. It's like a, a multiple hit uh, attack. Yeah, it's not too bad. So we've got two quests for killing bosses and we're gonna go ahead and kill those bosses. The boss on floor 20 and floor 10. We'll start off with floor 20. So yeah, since the last episode we've managed to upgrade three fighters. Uh, we've replaced our main three, the two collectors and our striker. They're now uh, grade four fighters, four star, and just about fully leveled, or at least in the stats that matter. So we've got our boss killer and our collectors ready for action. And we've got some strong weapons in the form of the Motor Psycho. How dare you! Okay. I think I'll be using this special mushroom against the next boss. Grilled Oak Shroom. Attack up 150%, next attack only. Don't remember where I got this from. May have been from the uh, Deathmobile. I haven't been this excited in a while. Time for your second challenge. You'll be fine. Don't worry. You're the hero. Disarming. There are three disarming devices in total. What's up, landmines and bananas? Okay, let's go kill everything. Can I not target you? Oh, okay. Never mind you. I can hear the, the disarm device nearby. Must be above us. Where is it? Oh, there it is. <coughs> yeah, yeah. This is not our first rodeo. Next one, where would it be? Not in this building. Hello? And you're poisoned! Bam! Yeah, that claw is pretty strong. It's the, uh, the upgraded claw. I can hear it. Oh, there it is. Go on. <laughs> Come on, man. Okay, there you got it. Beep, 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 beep. Just press all these buttons. Just uh, You're great scratch time, the screen and the bash time. the screen with the uh, the claw and the iron. That sounds like a bow intruder to me. Ooh, don't skill stream. I think that's 4 out of 4. That should be enough to buy another Poison Eater. Which is great. Come on, man. Ah, you conniving, devious. Just try it. Haha. 
You do perfect guard, don't you this? Denied. Not attack. Actually the iron, the red hot iron has got quite a few applications. Sounds like we're, uh, we're getting closer. I keep forgetting there's a there's a way into this building from the side, from uh, from behind. Uh, it's around here somewhere. Whoops, dude. Closer. Yep, there it is. Go on. Scratchy, scratchy. Yeah. Zero. Kaboom. The explosives. Good job. You're a hero. Hey, let's go get a stamp, shall we? Yes, let's. Right. So this buff will last indefinitely. This one may not has a limited durability. I'll use it anyway. Get the cloak room ready. Uh, let's go. Just don't hit me. Waiting for invisibility. And we're invisible. Charge of attack. What was that? Like 15,000 damage? Okay, well, you're dead. There we go, one quest complete. More green, sure, don't mind if I do. Yeah, these weapons are really strong. Their blunt damage, like 400 damage. Our previous strongest weapon was the Red Hot Iron Plus. I guess the claws is slightly, uh, slightly stronger than that. But now we've got 400 damage weapons, so uh, we're gonna be kicking ass in the Candle Wolf area. Congratulations! Let me snap a photo to commemorate your second large snap. Get on with it. Skip, skip, skip. Well, you managed to make it through your second real challenge. Impressive. Off we go then. Yeah, we'll be heading back to our first big challenge in a minute. Hopefully we'll be getting a uh, bronze skill stream there too. It seems there's a decent chance of getting those on the boss floors. I've seen the bronze stream pop Come on, load screen. Get on with it. Haven't got all day. Come attack. Hmm. I will take it. Hello. Smash. Yep. 
Yeah, these guys are, don't stand a chance now. Not against a striker with a 400 damage weapon. Not a chance. Be able to sprint for days too, with the stamina increase and the sprinter decal. Off to 10 we go. Probably gonna be farming a couple more golden uh, golden snails today. It's golden snail day. I like to have like at least ten in the bank, just in case. Well, they have come in handy leveling these fighters up real quick. Also, like to check out the uh, floors nineteen and eighteen for green uh, green medals from golden chests. On snail days, those do show up on those floors. Easy farming. Uh, would I heal? Sure, I'm gonna heal a little bit. I can't believe you made it this far, Senpai. This is your first big challenge on your way to the top. Joker. Yeah, this is uh, this is a pretty effective weapon. Like it's got a lot of forward motion to its attacks. Blam! Oop. Missed you. Oh bugger! Can we not kill those guys now? Oh! If we were not a on a kill, uh, kill everything quest, so we may have failed it by just falling down here. Oh no, they come down to us. Ugh, of course. Good job, buddy. You're a hero. Is that lasers? There's a dangerous trap on this train car. Be careful, son. Ooh, oh. I didn't seem that dangerous. Oh man, you're living on the edge, dude. Hey, what did I say? One skill tree. Great. Are you there? Whoops. Oh yeah, uh, there's been a lot of progress made on these quests too. I think I'm done with the bronze... Uh, the bronze pumpkin shrooms. Probably still working on the silver and gold pumpkin shroom quests. Sure. A little bit of healing. Oh, watch out. Uh, okay. Don't fall off. Don't fall off. No, 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 no. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Ah. Stay out of here. <laughs> Stay away, dude. I think I hit him. Yeah, this may not be a smart game of cat and mouse we're playing. I'm gonna try and uh, try and uh, <laughs> force my way in there. Whee! <laughs> and you got completely destroyed. Ah, an attack room. 
Yeah, we still got one. Hmm, they have lost a bit of damage. Are you fully leveled yet? No, not at all. There we go. Got a quest complete. Lord Blue. Amazing. Why would you ever find me here? Why do you not just go to floor 3 and uh, defeat Cohen over and over again? <laughs> Get ready. This is actually my second today. Nice work. Keep it up and you'll be at the top in no time. <laughs> so you Don't you uh, taunt me, Uncle Def. I'll be there uh, quicker than you can imagine. With these motorcycles, be there in a, in a jiffy. Come on, let me in. Uh, I think we'll go and go put these weapons to use. They cost 8,500 to purchase, which is not cheap. But the cooldown is only like 10 minutes to buy them. And uh, you can kind of farm them. Well, you can kind of buy them in bulk. If you just go and kill a few haters for kill coins at this point, they drop quite a decent amount. No haters here. I think I'll be using the Frongus, no, Fluffy Frongus, to deal with this next hater. I think I'll show off the, the grind move, or at least some application of it. Hello. Don't get up. <laughs> Check that. Now that's a hell of a lot of armor durability damage he just took. I don't know how much hits that was, but it's put him in a, a weird state. He's still not he's, in, he's not in a right state of mind from that attack. No, sorry. Oh, watch out. I'll hit him both to put you to sleep. And a little bit of the old... Wow. Yeah. Never saw it coming. Poor guy. Never stood a chance. Gonna be rare mushrooms. Yes. A rare mushroom. Ding, ding, ding. We've actually had quite a bit of luck with the rare mushrooms in this short boss uh, killing episode. Alright, 
Got a little bit of time left. I have to go and take out Go to a 9. No, thank you. Eh, this one should do. Small attack up. I'll take you with me. You're rare. And instead of a bronze plum consume, yeah, I don't need that. Okay. Actually, I wonder if you can just punch Goto to death with this fighter. Probably we could. Punch him to death with ease. Don't you dare. Oh. oh, gracious of you. There we go. If you have the bag space to spare, it, it's a good idea to drop some mushrooms on the floor. You can even walk into the arena and drop a harmful mushroom by opening your inventory and dropping it on the floor like this. And he'll go over to it and gobble it up. But only in his uh, low, uh, low HP phase. He won't eat that when he's uh, in his hunger phase. He'll only go to thrown mushrooms at that point. Or at least that's how I remember it working. Things keep changing. It's hard to keep track of everything. Uh, never mind. Actually. <laughs> Did that put you to sleep? No, you're okay. Okay, so that's those quests finished. Pretty easy with a four-star striker. So it's kind of a uh, a in-between Let's Play episode. War Red and Dot Red. So I may be doing those on the weekly. Get some easy uh, top grade materials. I'm reckoning those season weekly quests will continue indefinitely from now on so I would be a fool not to capitalize on those don't know what I'm gonna use the dot red on though like I may wait until I'm well into the 30 plus as to not get an unfair advantage I'd like to play the game as if we were back in the day when it first started Looks like that's going to be it for this episode. See you guys in the next one.